Hey. What the fuck? Hey guys. I got a webcam. As you can see. I don't know where to look. <laughs> I've never never used a webcam before. Um but yeah, I don't know how uh, great this is going to look. Um I'm not used to uh messing with cameras to be honest. So uh, I might have to like spend a few episodes adjusting the settings to make it look better. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna try out using a webcam for a while, see if I like it. Uh, I really need to repair my ship. Let's do that. That's a good start. I noticed that like there's a lot of glare on my glasses, and I'm not really sure how to fix that other than like getting contacts. I don't know if that's gonna, I don't know if that's like the best solution. Anyway, um, we were going to life pod 19, but I want to check this wreck out for a second. I can't remember if I've been here or not. Oh, I don't think I have. I have my laser cutter, right? Yeah, I think I can use that here. Oh, I've got it. I've got it equipped. Okay, sweet. Passing 100 meters. Oh, we should probably have our rebreather on. Sealed door. This is my first sealed door opening. I hope there's a modification station part in here. Man, this is gonna be so awkward. Like, I'm, I'm so bad. <laughs> at like face-to-face -face conversation and now that I feel you watching me uh it's that's gonna I'm gonna be so much worse I'm just gonna try my best to ignore it battery charger it's a um razor keo by the way I got it because like clearly I don't have very good lighting in here I could probably turn some lights on but they're not the best uh, and the Razer Keo had the ring light, so that's what I'm going with for now. I didn't even look at what that battery thing was. I'm going to be so distracted. Battery charger. Oh, cool. So we've got a power cell charger and then also a battery charger. Okay. I like that. Can I skin this? Nope. <gasps> oh, wait. No, that's not what I needed. I need a modification station. Okay. We can finish the battery charger at least. And that's pretty cool. I like that. Near blueprint acquired. Yeah, battery charger. Cool. I like that. I really need to figure out a better base. What is this? Can I just like cut this with my laser? No. I feel like. <clears throat> oh shit. Back to the sea moth. Quickly. I feel like that little box above the door might be a clue that I can get into it. But I don't know for sure. Let's just cut this one open. It's so bright. It's so bright. I need a... I need like a welding mask or something. Okay, more battery charger. Lightweight, high capacity tank. Oh, I like that. I like the sound of that. I want the ultra high capacity tank, but this'll do. I don't know if it's worth scanning these, because I don't want to fill my inventory up with titanium. I think it would be better just to remember it's here. And come back for it. Oh, look, a picture. That's sad. Is there anything here? 
People keep saying I need to use a flashlight. And I don't know if that's just because, like, the video's super dark. <gasps> a modification station! Okay. Maybe the flashlight is worth it because I didn't see that. Okay, let's get out of here. Well, there's this other door. It looks like it should open. Oh, I don't... Hang on. Let me just look at the back side. Okay, yeah, that's just that door, so... Clearly, it doesn't matter if I open it or not. I don't know if I'm staying in frame on the camera either. That's probably also something I'm going to have to work on. Okay, sweet. So we got a modification station. We just need to find one more. I need to keep an eye out for stuff like that. There might be something here. Oh, shit. Shit, what did I hit? Oh, probably that thing. Sorry. Yeah, you know what? I feel like there might be a good chance that there are more parts here. Scanner room I don't need. Shit, I wish it were daytime. What's that? Salvage? I think we might be fine. Yeah, I think I got everything here. I, it was a good haul. We got a battery charger, and then another piece of a modification station. So we just need one more. And maybe we'll find it at the second officer Keen's location. My bad. My bad. Uh. Whew. Okay, this is the uh, really deep area. And it's really dark. <laughs> I'm just gonna stick to the wall here as much as I can. This is good. Oh, I wanted to, uh... Oh, I'm like right at the maximum depth, too. I gotta be careful. I wanna try the, the laser cutter on these things. Let's see if this is what I actually use it for. No. I need something else. Okay, that's fine. I, I kind of, I kind of thought that, but didn't hurt to check. Maybe I. Warning: maximum depth reached. Right. All damage imminent. Oh, it's so dark here. But he's not that deep. Okay, we're still we're still like at the the floor here. What's this stuff? Oh cool, prawn suit torpedo arm. I need the the prawn suit though. Yeah, I need <laughs> I mean I'll take it. I'll take it for sure, but I need the prawn suit itself. New blueprint acquired. 
I don't know where that's going to be. Lightweight high capacity tank. I still need a modification station for it. Why does it matter? Oh, it just makes me move faster. There it is. Vehicle upgrades, yeah, but I don't have the the prawn suit, so it's not very useful to me. Ugh. We are deep. We are deep. I see like a PDA or something way over there. There's a lot to explore here. I think we're gonna have to scour this whole area before we get to the captain or the, the second officer, which I'll take that. It seems like he's just down that hole. What does the thermal plant do? Oh, uh, right. I think I can put these. Well, my guess is that I can put these on the, um, those like big heat vents that pop up. And, uh, well, I can't make it. I don't know why I pinned the recipe. Let's get those off. Aha! Gotta be something real good in here. You always gotta watch out. Always gotta watch your back. I think it's getting dawn, which is going to make me feel a lot better. Cyclops fire suppression system. 30 seconds. Oh, just grab this real quick. We got to get We got to get back to the uh acquired. Seamoth. Super quick. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you, Sheila. All right. In. Go. Oh, come on. There's got to be something cool here. This is like a secret area. Nothing? Okay. Seems secret to me. Where was my door? I don't need that anymore. I think there was something else in here, maybe? Oh, sweet! The last piece! What is this guy? Small sample flask. Micro... Not microphone. What did it say? Microscope. Non-functional. I guess it's just for decoration. Maybe I don't really care about that. Sample analyzer. Yeah, I think this is just like set pieces, probably. Okay, sweet. We got the fucking modification station. We can we can progress for real. This was such a good trip. We haven't even really started. Fluid intake. Oh, I'm dying. Warning. Maximum depth reached. Whoops. All damage imminent. Oops, I got a little too gung ho there. Oh, it's so deep here. I gotta stop looking out into the water. I can grab... Reginald. Oh, herbivore. High calorie count. Sharing that species well-developed side-facing eyes, approximate size, and body profile. Why is my inventory full? Because I've got all these junk. I don't think I want these. I'm dropping them. If I'm really desperate later, I can come back. Prawn suit, torpedo arm. Don't need. That's junk. I don't need. Thermal plant. Thermal plant. I thought I saw something else. 
Oh, that's spooky. That's spooky. Light stick. The heck is a light stick? Just like a standing torch? Yeah, okay. Cool. I like that. Could be useful. Power cell charger. Sweet. We got like four blueprints unlocked here. Okay, I want to get in here. I don't know if I have enough time. We can at least open it, I think, and then just run back to the Seamoth to get some air. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna go back real quick. Okay, cool. Let's get in here. Reinforced dive suit. Oh sweet, this is the various suit. <laughs> This is the Varia suit, the radiation suit. I think I said the radiation suit was the Varia suit, but this is the Varia suit. Reinforced dive suit. Why take chances when you can take Kaltera? Reduce incoming physical damage and thermal damage. That is so cool. When am I going to get the gravity suit? Power cell charger. Man, everybody had a picture of this one lady. Must have been Mrs. Altera. Okay, I don't think there's anything else here. I think we're cool. I think we're done. I mean, there might be more junk out here. I don't know. Seek fluid intake immediately. Oh, shit. Right. I think I can just eat raw fish. Nope. No, I cannot. I'm dead. Oh, I had soda. I mean water. I said soda because, like, that's from Stalker. Man, that's a good thing I brought some water. I don't know if it's worth eating these at this point. I think I need to drop it. Well, Vital signs. I'll just keep it. Thermal plant. I don't need that anymore. Thermal plant. I think it's just going to be thermal plant over and over. Let's, uh... Let's go find the captain. Let's, let's find the captain. Where's my boat? Oh, man, that freaked me out. Seeing the Leviathan way above us. That was spooky. It's... Oops, oops, that's not what I meant to do. Is this a new... Like, tool? How am I doing? Still infected. Get the knife out. It's nothing. This is nothing. Okay. Let's take one last... Um... Oxygen break. I should probably repair this thing too. Okay, that's good enough. Let's let's go down here. Diamond, cool. There's the life pod. Any bad guys in here? I think we're okay. Officer Keen. Here's a PDA. Keen, this is Aurora. Come in. This is Keen. Life pod detached to okay. planet fall in 30 seconds. The computer has identified a landmass at the attached coordinates. I want you to regroup the crew there. Understood, but they are your responsibility now. Don't 
let them down. Captain, you need to evacuate. Negative. You'll need the ship in one piece if you're going to contact HQ on the long range. I'm attempting a controlled descent. Captain! He probably made it. Captain's probably... Captain's probably living it up on the, the island that he found, just waiting for us. No doubt. Cyclops fire suppression system. Oh, for the... Okay, cool. I can make the thermal blade now? I can make all this stuff now. I gotta keep track of the new things that I unlock. I'm still missing... I still have one blueprint notification somewhere. I cannot find it. Okay, oh, oh, the diving suit, right, okay. Okay. I got a diamond, sure. Whatever. What are these? Look like Dr. Seuss plants. Ew. This is probably just gonna net me a seed, huh? Yeah, I don't want that. What is this? A ruby? Ooh. Ah! Oh. Oh, okay. It's just the plant. That scared me so bad. Okay. What is this? To all crew, if you're reading this, then you have followed the automatic distress signal broadcast by this life pod's onboard computer, contrary to my orders. I've been forced to evacuate. Your orders are to disregard my safety and attempt to reach the designated rendezvous coordinates at the nearest landmass. I hope to see you there. Okay. Do we have those coordinates? Is it like in my beacon manager? Oh yeah, it is! Oh, that's so good! Integrating new PDA data. Okay, sweet. I... I feel like there's not gonna be dry land that doesn't really seem like what was that I didn't like unlock a boss fight by finding that PDA did I there's not gonna be a giant monster when I swim up there <gasps> in fact I need to swim up there right now I'm really low on oxygen 30 seconds. don't eat me please don't eat me I think we're okay. There's probably more stuff down there. But I've got so much stuff on me right now. Should I just head straight to the rendezvous point? I kind of want to. It's not that far away. Just see what's up. I don't think we're like, we're not like desperate for resources. I'm out of water, but. Um, ooh, ooh, there's a ball down there. There's a ball. There's a big shiny ball. Oh, oh. that's, I know this is weird, but I, I don't want to go up. <laughs> I don't want there to be a lot of water below me. Ooh, that does look like dry land though. What the fuck is that noise? What the fuck is that noise? I'm freaking out. <laughs> I'm freaking out, man. Oh, there's some rocks falling. That's really cool, but... Just go up. Just go up. That's a giant monster, isn't it? That's like a giant fish or something. No, it's just dry land. Okay. Let's... I have... 
let's just go. Let's just go. I want to get onto land right now. I want to get onto land right now. Don't leave me! <laughs> it just shot off without me. Uh, okay. Okay, we're Picking on dry land. Energy signatures on the island's surface. Is that good? Are they monsters? Where's my gun? I didn't know there was actually, like, land in this game. I thought it was all ocean. This is cool. Why don't I just build a base here? I don't... It's really concerning that it's floating? But... It is... It is land. It's dirt and rock. Common land fungus found in clusters. Voxel shrub. Pink leafed plant with an angular angular appearance, which grows exclusively on land. Okay. This is really cool. I was not expecting this at all. Speckled rattler. Is this edible? That'd be pretty nice. Brittle land plant containing large spores which generate a characteristic rattle when the plant is shaken. This may act to ward off predators or even encourage predation as a means of spreading the spores. I don't know if I want to eat them. Does it say eat? No. Alright. Those trees over there look kind of weird. Oh, there's more of those evil crabs. Oh, there's a structure up there. This is so cool. I like this a lot. Ming plant. Are you edible? Predation and repairs over time. Explaining character the characteristic cracks on the side. Okay. This is awesome. Okay, so there's the observatory up there. I oh, there's another one there. There's no way that there's actually people. What if I just dive in and <laughs> there's, there's a giant monster waiting with its mouth open. Oh fuck, I guess I'm doing it. Oh, okay. Oh, I don't like it. Let me get, let me get over here. We have to board the Aurora, repair the long range comms, make contact with the other survivors. We can't be the only two that made it. Those are not the orders the captain gave me, and they are not the orders I'm giving you. This isn't chain of command, it's survival. My obligations as acting commander don't turn on their convenience. Get out of the water. If I get into trouble, I'll send you my coordinates. I can't let you go alone. Then come with me. You don't leave me much choice. Received emergency transmission from second officer Keen. Oh he shit, they're dead. After last activity. They're dead. Rendezvous was a failure. Intercepted a transmission from Altera HQ. Seems they sent a data package to the Aurora. We were intercepted by a Leviathan-class predator before we could reach the ship. Consider the CTO and I lost at sea. Be safe. Keen. What? Out. Just come back here. I'm here. I need help. I need. I need somebody to get eaten for me, so I don't have to be. Okay, well, let's... I mean, I'm not surprised that there's not anybody here. Pink cap. Harvestable spores. Inedible. Is anything edible on this island? Get off of me! Just get up. Just get up. 
I want to get up into there. And not eaten by some monster out here. Just jump. There's another one there. I wonder if this is, uh... I, it seems like the captain and whoever he was with did not stay very long. So I think these are probably not from anybody on the Aurora. These might be the Degasi crew. Or maybe somebody else. Let's take a look. Disinfected water. Don't mind if I do. Oh, it is. It's Bart this Torgel. Is the first time I've seen sunlight in months. After all that time in the deep, I'd been dreaming of it. Now that I'm back here, I'm finding it hard to enjoy alone. My father was right. We should never have left this place. We shouldn't have gone so deep. They do not want us down there. Despite my best efforts, ill health is taking hold of me. The visions are getting worse. Marguerite and Father are now part of the ecosystem of this incredible planet. It's reassuring to know that when I go, I'll join them. Until then, well, there's always the view. Okay, so, uh, they're dead. No, I always do that. I do not want to drop it. I want to drink it. Can I scan a bulkhead? Oh, cool. Bulkhead door. Why is this different than a hatch? Separate compartments while reinforcing structural integrity with its solid titanium frame. The door can be opened and closed to seal off compartments in the event of fire or flooding, or simply for privacy. I don't really like the fact that, um... <laughs> that the structures you build have, like, an integrity? What is this? Holy shit! Food! I should probably scan this. Oh, this is cool. Oh, I like that. Let's just go ahead and eat Reginald. Just fill up, why not? Okay, that's, that's good enough. I'm stuck on something. Grub basket. What is that? Grubs and insects are attracted to the bright petals, make their way to the center of the plant, but are unable to scale back up the slick inner leaves and are ultimately digested. Oh, that's cool. Indoor grow bed. Well, I guess I'm gonna need this if I wanna grow food. Because this is the only growable food that I know of right now. Oops. Just pick that back up. Okay. Cool. We're finding so much good stuff. So much new good stuff. I think that's all there is here. What is that? Oh, just a bird. Bird, 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 bird. Let's let's investigate these other structures. This one looks like the main house. So this should have all the best stuff, I would assume. Got to watch out for those guys. Chinese potato. Come on, make it. 
Chinese potato. Chinese potato. I definitely want this exterior grow bed. Anywhere on land or underwater. Oh, I guess, well, if you install it on land, it probably has to be only land-based plants. Marble melon. Okay. High water content. Cool. I don't... Why wouldn't I just make a base here? This seems like a great place. It is, like, kind of in deep water. Which maybe isn't a problem once I get more set up. It seems so much safer to be on land. I don't want all that stuff clogging up my inventory. Purple tablet. some kind of alien tech carbon date carbon based device is lighter than it looks and features a symbol which represents a U lit up in purple despite the onboard power still functioning algae growth on the exterior indicates it was abandoned hundreds perhaps thousands of years ago while the technology is far beyond Federation levels and there's no obvious way to interface with it it should nonetheless be possible to fabricate a precise physical copy of the device if necessary. Oh, okay, so there's some kind of like alien component to this game. Ooh. Ooh. What is that thing? I don't know. I found it outside in the sand. Uh, part of another ship? None I've ever seen. It's not even scratched. Uh, don't fool around with it. It might be worth something. Stand down, Chief. If it were going to crumble to dust, it would have done so when I picked it up. It's glowing. We're not the first people to come to this planet. People? Maybe. Could be aliens. Could be the damn sea monsters for all we know. One thing for sure, we ain't going to find out by staying here. Spooky. Spooky alien technology. <gasps> what the fuck? What is this? Get me out of here. What just happened? Hang on. Die. Die. You... You little bastard. I think it's dead. Okay. Oh, I thought there was gonna be a door here. How do I get in there? What time is it? Still got a little bit of time. No. Did that do it? Okay, sweet. So it just puts a stasis field up, I guess, kind of. Son, I said wait for the storm to pass. Your life's more valuable to me than a plant patch. You stop being in charge when the ship you were captaining sunk. Whoa, I'll stop Mark. being in charge when you take charge of yourself. Say, Chief. Chief. What? Do you know how to drain those grow beds of 40 tons of storm water? Or how to conjure food from the air? I know how to prioritize. I'm just saying, if that's so, what's your boy's life worth to you today? If tomorrow you're going to be so hungry you start wondering what it tastes like. Let him go deal with the plants. Son, go deal with the plants. Bard, 
Torgo has disembarked the habitat. Interfere with my family again, and when rescue arrives, I will leave you here. Do you understand me? No rescue coming, Chief. Not in time. And no staying here, neither. This rain keeps falling, sooner or later this place will be buried. The only choice we got is whether to get buried with it. Is that... So should I not build a base on this island? Is it just going to get rained on? I haven't seen rain, I don't think. Battery? Okay. Don't mind if I do. Chief's log, five weeks since the crash. The only other survivors are my son, Bart, and Mida, the cut price mercenary I commissioned for the journey. After days drifting in the life pod, rain hammering on the roof, the weather cleared and we washed up here. I had Mida salvage the Degazi wreck, set Bart to finding us a stable source of food. His education is paying off sooner than I'd anticipated. Our only problem is Mida. She says the weather's going to turn. I say she's finding excuses to risk our lives. I imagine she's not gonna weaken her life without a physical altercation, and she's itching for a fight. In every judgment she makes, things go from bad to worse. If she had my experience, she'd have more faith. Humans have spent millennia specializing in how to shackle nature to our will. <laughs> this planet won't cause us any new problems. Oh, ho, ho. I don't know about keep that. Us alive, as comfortably as possible, until the insurance company arranges rescue. In this part of space, that could be months, or even years. Yeah, probably more like years. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Why? Why? Okay. Cool. I want that ladder in my base. What? There's nothing to scan up here? I thought this was gonna be like a secret or something. Whatever. Come on. Okay. Ah! Okay. That's fine. I still got that one up there to do. Bobo tree. I have a seed for this. Edible? The whole tree? A bulb based floor which roots to the ground and sprouts turquoise leaves. Analysis suggests the sap produced by this plant is poisonous to insects but can be harvested and consumed by humans for its high water content. Cool. How? Yeah, I'll figure it out. I think I just want to build a base here. I don't see why not yet. You see, Chief, you brought us to this sodden planet. Told us we'd see a lush payday. Now what do we got some six weeks later? A dead crew, a habitat that's half buried, food washed away. I suppose the executive decisions would be better left to someone with your extensive experience of hitting people in the face. I know enough not to take unscheduled detours to uncharted planets. That's something you don't want to learn the hard way. Easy to judge a decision in hindsight. Harder to come up with a plan of your own. Got one already. Take what we can carry and hunker down in a cave somewhere. I scouted a site, a couple hundred meters deep, lots of metal deposits. How do you imagine we'd live? With ready access to building materials, like damn queens. A couple of water filters, a bioreactor, fresh fish. But Chief, we'll eat seaweed salad and drink our own urine if that's what it takes. All that matters is, do you got something better? Send the coordinates to my PDA. I'll review your proposal. Integrating new PDA. That data. doesn't make any sense. That doesn't make any sense to me. How is living underwater 
like better or safer than living on this island even with the rain because like you could just you're <laughs> when you're underwater you have to put everything inside so you could just do that up here on dry land just put everything inside put your bioreactor and whatever and then just like fish like normal people like off the side of the island or whatever or just like have a little submarine to collect fish in why do you need to live underwater that doesn't make any sense i'm not talking about like from the gameplay perspective i'm just talking about like you know realistically from a narrative perspective. Doesn't make sense to me. Can I Skyrim this? Nope. Maybe I should try and stick to some semblance of a path because I've been finding PDAs out here. And it's like really pretty. I should just enjoy the walk. Like what the heck? There's so much vegetation. How how could they have been run off? Did I just hear something? I think I imagined it. How could they have been run off this island because it rained a lot? That doesn't make any sense to me. <clears throat> okay, we're almost to the top. I think we'll call it uh, when I get to the top because uh, it's starting to get to that hour mark. I know that the the path goes up higher. I'm just I'm just trying to see if there's any like PDA or like artifact or something out here. That's probably just the way you're supposed to go next, I guess. It's incredible that they managed to land the Aurora <laughs> like on the most shallow part of the entire ocean to where 90% of it could be sticking out of the water. Like if we could like fix that up and put out the fires or whatever, you could just live in there. That would be a great place to live. It's gigantic. And safe. Other than the front and back. Where the, the Reaper <laughs> Leviathans are. Okay. Can I scan these? I can scan the pot. I guess this just grows like a smaller version of the plants wherever it is yeah that's that's what I guess might as well pick them what the fuck I just want to eat this maybe I should keep one okay this should be like the the big the big PDA there's going to be some kind of big reveal or something here this island is a godsend look out of the window no predators fresh food that's what no i keep saying materials, nothing left of the ship bring the building materials here starve without more grow beds 
Speak up, Put the kid. bulb heads inside. The natural growth rate is too slow to keep supporting. It's it. not. There are so many bulbo trees. No use hiding. And you could just get later, fish. We'll get our you can just get fish from the ocean. The rest of your life may have been a fight made up, but I've made my decision. You want to forfeit your emergency pay to take a swim? Go ahead. Believe me, I'm thinking on it. Okay, that was nothing. That that PDA did not reveal any new information. Did not enlighten us. Um, is there anything to scan in here? I think we're good. I think we're good to go. Okay. Um, I'm thinking uh, this might just be our new home. If I can cut down the trees for sure. I don't even know. Actually... It might not even let me build here. Where's my habitat builder? Five. Let's see. Let's try. Just, I don't know. Just place something. Place a foundation. No, I can build here. Okay. So yeah, what the heck? Why, why wouldn't I just build here? This seems so good. This seems like so nice. I can build a crazy base. I can build a crazy base out here. Look how high up you can build these. This would be so cool. Why wouldn't I build it here? Okay, okay, get this enough. Get it off my screen. Are there any other, like, PDAs or, or artifacts or, or building materials or anything? Where do they even find the melons? I haven't seen any naturally growing. I think we're good. I think... I think we're done with the island. Oh, no, there's some more grow beds here. This is Bart's farm. Bart's farm. We could seriously just like... Just like right here. Like... Spanning across this chasm here. That would be cool. Just to build, like, a, a big house here? In this, um... Fuck, I don't know what that's called. I think I want to do this. Because, hang on. Foundation. What the heck? Oh. Can I scroll it out or something? Can I get it further away from me? No. Whoa, careful. If I could just put a foundation, like, right here. Maybe I can't. I can't tell if it's because it's, like, clipping through or because it doesn't have any support. Oh, yeah, like, right here. Just start, like, right here. Hopefully I can get it lower, but you get the idea. And then just build a, a big base here. And any, like, underwater structures we need, we can just put underneath it in the water. And then and then we could have, like, a cool submarine bay or something. And it's got a beautiful view of the ass end of the Aurora. I like this idea. I just have to get over the fact that, <laughs> like, straight down is a really deep ocean. And I don't want to think about it. <laughs> but other than that, I really, I think I want to build here. And then they've already got a bunch of plants set up. So I'm good on food. That's going to be next time. I don't know. I kind of hunch over. I've just, I've probably been like in the corner of the webcam the whole game. I don't know. I can't tell. My hair is a mess. Okay, anyway, thanks for watching, uh, and I'll see you next episode.